starting at the end of 2017 when we went to Vegas for New Year's Eve weekend. Here's a picture out our plane window and then a picture of the strip in the background as we're landing in Las Vegas. After this, we went to the warehouse where Tanked is filmed, where we met Brett, Wade, and the General. And then I got to sit in Brett's office chair. We took a couple more pictures of things that were at the warehouse. After that, we got dropped off at the Flamingo, where we took a couple pictures. And then this happened. Here's the final result from that. After that, on our way to eat, we saw a thunderstorm in Planet Hollywood. Then we ate at the Rainforest Cafe, and on our way back to our condo, we met Piff the Magic Dragon. And that was the end of our first day. The second day, when we woke up, we went to take a picture in front of the Welcome to Las Vegas sign. Then we explored the hotels a little bit. Here's a video from the Bellagio Fountains, one of my favorite things about Vegas. After that, we went to Hershey's World and then visited the Coca-Cola factory where we got to taste the Cokes from around the world. We went to Caesar's Palace, saw the statues, and Stephen wanted to take a picture in front of the Hell's Kitchen sign. Later that night, we went to Bally's to eat at BLT Steak. After dinner, we went on a helicopter ride and got to explore the Strip. Here's a picture of us in front of the helicopter, and that ends day two. Day three in Vegas was New Year's Eve. We explored the hotels a little bit more. Then we went to the Venetian to go on a gondola ride. After that, we went to a party at Treasure Island where we watched the ball drop. We went outside to watch the fireworks when it hit midnight. And that concludes day three. On our last day in Vegas, we went to the top of the stratosphere got to overlook the city. Then we decided if we didn't go on the x scream ride, then we'd be upset with ourselves. So we went on the roller coaster where it feels like you're gonna fall off the top of the building. Then we went to downtown Vegas where we got to hug a million dollars. And that concludes our Vegas trip. After Vegas, we came back from winter break, back to school to finish our senior year of college. We had bowling tournaments. We visited each other at the colleges a bunch of goofy pictures and then Easter came around. Here's my brother with us. More goofy pictures. And then we got to go see Mo Wagner who was a basketball player at the U of M and now plays for the Lakers. Steven had his bowling banquet that I went with him to. More silly pictures. After that was graduation. This is Steven's graduation. Shortly after was my graduation. After graduation, we went on a summer road trip across the East Coast. First stop was Niagara Falls in Canada. Sorry for everyone who has to use the bathroom right now. Here's a picture of us in front of the falls. Then we did the journey behind the falls and got stuck down there when we came up. This is what we saw. We went to another location where the Niagara Falls runs. After that, we went on the Maid of the Mist where you get to go on a big boat right up next to the falls, which is probably my favorite attraction at Niagara Falls. After that, we went to a speedway to do a Mario Kart attraction. Then we got to see a volcano from a ferris wheel. Here's the falls lit up at night.
After Niagara Falls, we drove through a couple states to get to Maine. Where we visited some of Stephen's family members. We went to the beach even though it was a little chilly. Drew in the sand. Stephen wanted to mimic a tree. Then we went up to Portland to try lobster rolls. We saw this really cool church. Then we went to see George H.W. Bush's house. This is our car ride to New York. Here's us with a picture of the Statue of Liberty. Here's a picture of the city. Here are a couple pictures from on top of the Empire State Building. Here's the ball that they drop on New Year's Eve in Times Square. Then we went to eat at Hard Rock Cafe before traveling to Atlantic City where Steven got tired in the car. Here's us pulling up to Atlantic City. Then we drove to Philly just to get cheesesteaks. Here's a picture of our hotel room in Atlantic City. After three days there, we went to Cedar Point where we saw Kane Brown getting off the dragster. Here's a view from our hotel room with a great picture of a sunset in the background. Another good picture of us with the sunset. The next morning we got to eat with Charlie Brown and Snoopy. And we went on our favorite ride, the Millennium Force. Took a picture of our Jordans that we got in New York. And then it was the 4th of July. A couple weeks later, I found our first YouTube video. The day after, we went on our double date with my best friend from college and her boyfriend. Then we pulled a prank on Steven's dad. We went disc golfing on one of the hottest days of the year. Then we celebrated Steven's birthday. We went to our favorite cider mill to get donuts and slushies. Whoa, we took more goofy pictures. Here's a picture of my two dogs, Zoe on the left and Willow on the right. Here's a picture of us going to the Thomas Rhett concert. Here's our holographic tickets. Us in our hotel room getting ready to leave for the concert. Midland opened for him and then Brett Young. to a couple of my brother's football games. He is the kicker on his team. Here's where we filmed our inspirational video. Make sure to check that out. Then we went to the mall and met our friend Roscoe. I wanted to take him home so bad, but we weren't allowed to. Then I got a new desk that Steven helped me build. Then it was time for Halloween. Here's our pumpkins, mine's an M&M's. Stevens is a football helmet. My brother's is on the left. 
for Halloween, we decided to be reindeer because we were in the Christmas spirit. Then we filmed our Guess How Many Challenge. Nobody guessed the correct number. It was 312 M&Ms in the jar. Then I bought Steven his dream car. Then it was Thanksgiving when we went Black Friday shopping. Steven accepted an assistant coaching position at his college. Hi, Travis. Here we adopted Christmas families and we are wrapping Christmas presents for them. Then we went to see A Star is Born, one of my favorite movies. We went to see the Christmas lights at Heinz Park. And then we ended up getting my brother tickets to go see Piff the Magic Dragon live. Then after Christmas, we went and bought a really cool popcorn machine. And that concludes our 2018 year. We hope you guys enjoyed looking at our memories from 2018 and hope you made some memories of your own. Now we get to look forward to 2019. Hope you guys have a great year. Stay tuned for more videos. Thank you for made it to the end of this video. If you aren't subscribed already, please hit that subscribe button. Like this video. Share this video everywhere. We really appreciate all the love and support you guys give to us. Be passionate. Be inspiring. And always remember that nothing, nothing is, is impossible. impossible.